Welcome to the Pilates Show Mondays outside the Pilates studio, where we get out into the real world to explore the mind-body lifestyle. So today I'm going to be talking a little bit about how I set my intent for each and every day. Uh, it's really important to me to be calm and focused and think a little bit about myself and my life before I go and be of service to others inside of the studio. So uh, I'm a creative person, so I like to do this in lots of different ways. Sometimes it's mantras, sometimes it's listening to different types of prayers. But one of my most favorite ways, I call it one of my gypsy ways, it's from my, my Russian heritage, is that I love like to pull intent cards every single morning. Now there's lots and lots of different decks that you can use. They're all over the internet, lots on Amazon. Um, Doreen Virtue makes some great decks. Some of them are religious, some of them aren't. And this deck that I wanted to highlight today is um, the Wild Unknown Animal Spirit Guidebook. This is one of my most favorite decks. They're not only absolutely beautiful to look at, each and every animal has a different type of significance. They're telling you a little bit of something through the day. So there's really nothing to it. It's all via the power of intention and fun is you can shuffle it like you'd shuffle a regular deck of cards or you can just mill through, find a card that wants to speak to you, flip it over, Ooh, earthworm, I gotta read about that. And then it comes with a book that tells you a little bit about what earthworm energy is about and see how that pertains to you that day. So again, just a really fun way to work with some cards to set an intent for your day. And some clients even love to have you pull cards for them um, before their sessions. So give it a go and I hope you have fun with it. That's it for today. If you have a different take on today's subject or if there's anything you'd like to see covered in an upcoming episode, we'd love to hear from you. Comment below, on Facebook, Twitter, or in the forum at fusionpilatesedu.com. See you next time and never stop learning.